as flavorful as its past, Malolo City's masterpieces are great discoveries with their rich histories, ecstatic tastes, and uniqueness. Because of their promise to our cravings, specialties from the area are leaving their mark not just in Bulacan but also around the map. It is truly difficult to keep precious treasures hidden in just one place. When their values are screaming for recognitions, making their name and creating traditional yet innovative changes in our food culture. Santa Veronica Birang, one of the Malala's rarity, a dish so delicious, it will definitely tickle your interest and arouse your sense of taste. Uh, good afternoon, ako si Gloria Reyes Sigala ng Santo Niño Malolos, Bulacan. Ang topic natin ngayon ay Santa Veronica Birang. Ang Santa Veronica Birang ay galing sa, sa pangalan ng aming patron saint ng Reyes, si Santa Veronica. Si Santa Veronica ay siya si mga, sa, sa, isa sa mga characters nung panahon ng, ni Kristo, yung kanyang passion and death. Siya ay isang babae na midwife Nung pagkatapos niya mag, mag, doon sa kanyang trabaho midwife, lumabas siya, nakita niya si Kristo, napasampasan yung krus, nagkataon siya ay may dalampanyo, alampin, nakita niya hirap na hirap si Kristo sa kanyang krus at puro duguan. So ginawa niya, lumapit siya kay Kristo para pahira ng, ng birang. Birang, ibig sabihin yun ay yung malaking panyo. So sa atin ngayon ay lampin. Saan originate yung birang? Ang Santa Veronica birang na po tayo na originate sa lola ko. Kasi tuwing bahal na araw, lumalabas si Santa Veronica, umuwi yung mga kamag-anak namin na Manila para siya ay igayakan at iposisyon. Ang ginawa ng lola ko kasi maraming mga tira-tira, so naging bento siya. Ang ginawa niya, umuha siya ng sinsal. Sinsal, yun yung Kumbaga sa atin panyo, yun yung intern uh, sa loob ng, ng baboy. Siya yung nagko-connect doon sa small and large intestine. Made with a variety of ingredients used in cooking favorite Filipino dishes, Santa Veronica's Birang, a sumptuous traditional meal of breadcrumbs, tomatoes, rock salt, pickles, raisins, pepper, flour, potatoes, oil, longganisang makaw, eggs, and the main ingredients, grind beef and sinsal. In creating your own Santa Veronica's Birang, you shall start first by mashing the potatoes, then start chopping the tomatoes and longganisang makaw before mixing them with the grind beef, raisins, and pickles. After that, spread the mashed potatoes all over the prepared sinsal and top it with the mixed ingredients and cheese. The sinsal shall be rolled and covered with the elastic cellophane. Let it be steam for one hour. While cooking, prepare the egg whites, breadcrumbs, and flour. After an hour, take the boiled birang out of the pot. Coat it with the egg white, flour, and breadcrumbs before deep frying. For the sauce, extract the juices from the earlier boiled birang, then dissolve the cream of mushroom powder in it. Heat butter in a bowl and pour the mixed liquid with it. Slice the fried birang and pour the mushroom sauce on top of it. The birang is ready to be served and tasted. So, let's have a taste. Amazing! With its rich flavor and history, Santa Veronica's Birang is surely a treat for Filipinos all around the map. Malolos is truly the city of history, cultures, and great finds rolled into one. Santa Veronica Birang is another proof of its wonderful homage to country's pride and undiscovered gems. This is Nair de la Cruz. Till next time!